Hello everyone. Thank you for visiting Mondo channel. Here, I have a question for you. Do you need something to help you relax? If the answer is yes, maybe you are tired of the stress around you. Then, why not try Ikebana to relieve your stress? Every time when I have a chance, I recommended the fun of Ikebana to people around me. However, they have some preconceptions as follows. Ikebana seems too conservative and traditional, so I'm not sure it's for me. I have no time, no money, and nowhere to put flowers. I have learned Ikebana before, but I'm not good at following strict rules. I just want to enjoy flowers. Many people had a negative impression of Ikebana. But I think flowers have the power to make you happy. That's why I want you to feel free to put flowers close to you. Of course, when you are doing Ikebana, it helps you relax. But there are many other benefits as well. For example, Ikebana also improves creative ability to think about the composition of flowers. Concentration to complete work in a short time. Good judgment to choose the best flower combinations and the best placement for each flower. Decisiveness knowing when to stop. The skill we learn in Ikebana can help us in our daily lives. While thinking about how to make it easy for anyone to enjoy flowers, if I can explain in an easy to understand manner that I casually put the leftover flower materials in a small vase, I may be able to express it as a simple Ikebana. Then I came up with an idea to make it super simple. That is, you only need three flower stems. You can use any vase and you don't need a kenzan. If you have the space for one coaster, you can put it anywhere. Now I'd like to introduce you to a very simple type of ikebana. So let's start. Minimalist ikebana. One, two, three. First of all, you will prepare two kinds of flowers, three stems in total. A flower vase or glass with a height of about 15 cm. One or two bamboo skewers. This is used if necessary. Scissors to cut flowers. Then preparation part one. First, prepare the flower vase. A plain glass is fine, but it is recommended that you cannot see the inside of the water. Then pour water into the vase. Add until 90% full for the, for the time being. Finally, add the missing part. Next, preparation part 2. Prepare two kinds of flowers in total of three stems. There are many shapes of flowers but here we choose two different types of flower to make it easier to compose a framework. One is a vertically long type A, for example, slim silhouette, long flower face, the tip of a tree branch, and sword-shaped leaf. The other is a wider type B, for example, heavy silhouette, wide flower face, leafy stem and spray type. The composition of three flowers is two type A and one type B or one type A and two type B for the total of three. The size of two of the same type can be different. Then it is step one from here. Select the first flower to be inserted first from type A and decide the length. 
If there are two type A flowers, the one with the largest flower, thick and the firm branches should be the first flower. The length of the first flower is about twice the height of the base and therefore about three times the height of the base. After cutting off the excess part with scissors, insert it from the back of the vase. Seen from the side, it looks like this. Next step 2. Select the second flower from type B flower and decide the length. If there are two type B flowers, the one with a beautiful flower shape should be the second flower. The second flower should reach one third of the way up the visible part of the first flower when it is inserted into the base and tilted forward by 45 degrees. After cutting off the excess part with scissors, insert the second flower by tilting it 45 degrees forward so that it will be attached to the side of the first flower. Seen from the side, it looks like this. Here, it is easy to remember if you imagine the first flower is the father and the second flower is the mother. Lastly, step 3. Finally, insert the third flower. The third flower can be the first brother or the second brother the first sister or the second sister, depending on the type of flower. No matter which flower is the third flower, the first flower and the second flower are always in the same place. Also, among the same type of flowers, the size of the flower is proportional to age. In other words, among type A flowers, father is the largest, followed by the first brother and the second brother. Of the type of B flowers, mother is the largest, followed by the first sister and the second sister. Let's look at the case of each brother and sister. First, if the third flower is the first brother, B1, insert the first brother flower beneath the father flower's face by sifting it to the left or right not directly below. Then it's done. Next, if the third flower is the first sister, S1, insert the first sister flower above the mother flower's face by sifting it to the left or right, not directly above. Then it's done. Next, if the third flower is the second brother, B2, Insert the second brother flower above the mother flower's face by sifting it to the left or right, not directly above. Then it's done. Finally, if the third flower is the second sister, S2, insert the second sister flower beneath the mother flower's face by sifting it to the left or right, not directly below. Then it's done. The insertion position of the third flower, it looks like this. It is okay to reverse the position of the third flower. So, let's review today. First, insert the first flower. Then next, insert the second flower. Finally, insert one of the brother's or sister's flowers as the third flower. The completed form of the four pattern looks like this. In both cases, the father flower and the mother flowers are always in the same place. So how is it? It's very easy, isn't it? Only three flowers, but three flowers. Even with three flowers, it is a lot of fun to decide the length, angle, and insert wild faith in the flower. I'm sure something will change by decorating the flower around it. Then I'll show you some examples with real flowers from the next time, so please look forward to it. If you can refer to the contents of this video, please send me your likes. 
and please subscribe to this channel so that you won't miss it next time. Thank you for watching until the end. Love to live with flowers. Thank you.